I'm here with Craig Powell, who is a local photography and nature enthusiast and will be instructing the Capture Nature Photography Workshop on February 13th at the Chesapeake Heritage Visitor Center. Can you tell me a little bit about yourself and your interest in nature photography? Sure. Uh, I got interested in photography about 30 years ago. Took a few classes uh, just to learn some of the basics and uh, moved to Kent Island about 14 years ago and renewed my interest in photography probably about four years ago when the kids were getting older and had more time to to get out and get a, get around to the different nature centers and just been involved with it ever since. And can you tell us some of the topics you'll be covering in the workshop? Sure, we'll be talking about things like uh, exposure, uh, how ISO, shutter speed and aperture all well, apply to photography and, and the different effects that you can get with with using those, those items. Uh, we'll also be talking about the rules of composition, uh, post-production work and backup strategies. And what should people attending bring with them? Uh, since we're going to be going to see back afterwards, uh, you'll want to bring a camera and dress appropriately. It's going to be in February. It will likely be cold. And what can they expect to see here out on the trails? You see a number of water birds. Seabeck uh, uh, also has uh, 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 red tail hawks, uh, 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 great horned owls, uh, barred owls, and screech owls uh, that have been injured in the past. And uh, we'll be spending the rest of our life here. Now I'm here talking to Judy Wink, who's the Executive Director here at Chesapeake Bay Environmental Center. And can you tell us a little bit more about the field trip that the attendants will be taking here? Well, I think Craig will be taking the people out to actually photograph birds. And we have some waterfowl to photograph as well as some woods birds. Uh, we have a lot of open areas and probably to get them started, you need in the wintertime birds are pretty uh, seclusive and uh, you need some open areas so that uh, you can get the shots of the birds. The birds that we have around here that might be interesting to shoot are tundra swans, a lot of waterfowl right now because in the winter they stay here to overwinter, a lot of food at shelter. So we have waterfowl that they probably can get pretty close to because the waterfowl actually think their safety is on water. And we have warblers, yellow rumped, black and white. I, I'd say probably the best one to photograph, though, is brown-headed nuthatches. They're very rare in that they're contained to local pockets, you know. You have a little pocket here on Seabeck, and then you may go 100 miles and not have another pocket of those same birds. So a lot of things. And if they're lucky, they might catch foxes, otters, you know, depends what's moving that day. The Capture Nature Photography Workshop is on Saturday, February 13th at the Chesapeake Carriage Visitor Center at 10 a.m. The cost for the workshop is $15 per person and seating is limited to 30 people. To sign up, go to visitqueenanns.com or call the Queen Anne's County Tourism Office. Pre-registration is required.